alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. I got one minute to show you an issue and then something beautiful. Here's something beautiful. Maybe you can't see it, but that is the uh, sunset in Hamilton by the Mountain Masjid. Now, I have about 40 seconds to show you this. This is only a fraction of the water bottle usage and waste that goes on at the Mountain Mosque in, uh, <clears throat> on an average daily basis. The bag doesn't look that big, but there's about 20, maybe 30 water bottles in there. And this is only from the woman's area on the first floor. So it's a very small room and Iftar hasn't even started yet. So I have no idea how many water bottles have been wasted in that room today or in the whole mosque for one day or in the whole mosque for a period of 30 days. But we really need to solve this problem, inshallah. Let's see, I have a, just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven water bottles out here show you how just how much water has been wasted you know this bottle was m probably 85 to 90 percent uh, drinking but even that a lot of water can be left a little bit more now I'm using it to water a tree that's mostly dead but you know Allah knows best this water bottle is about 10 percent drinking the whole thing is was in the garbage bin all of it was going to go straight to the garbage and all this water is never going to get taken out from the bottle if it sits in the garbage. So, alhamdulillah, I have to use it for something. So I thought I would give it to these trees. Now, I really need to think about what we're doing. You know, there's so much water here that it even started to get overflowed. So you can see all the water in there. So if we started to use this water instead of just throwing it in the garbage, we could really make a change, inshallah. So may Allah guide us and help us do better. Once again, this is another nightmare of our... Uh, Masjid today. Uh, I don't know if this is from one day, if this is from two days, if this is from a mass cleanup of the mosque, but basically uh, we have a full dumpster and about eight to ten other bags of garbage. So much garbage is out here that uh, it's just all over the place. It's a mess. We got everything from food to groceries to water bottles. And I found here one bag. Someone has either left their bag donated their bag or someone you know just wanted to get rid of it or was lost in the mosque maybe lost and found when I looked inside subhanallah it's a full bag of uh, brand new nice clothing you know nothing looks dirty nothing looks overly used I think this is the only piece of dirt I can see on all of the clothes subhanallah they're brand new so we really need to rethink as a community what we're doing with our money what we're doing with our time what we're doing with our wealth what we're doing to please Allah and how we're using the resources we have. You know, subhanAllah, material objects can work, last very long or they can last very temporarily, very uh, shortly. And often this has to do with the blessings of Allah, uh, sorry, the, the, the amount of blessings that Allah puts into these objects. Now, many of these things might have just been used for nonsense, a few sips taken out of a bottle. No one was maybe, maybe people weren't mindful of Allah when they consumed the goods here. Maybe, uh, you know, people who bought these clothes, maybe they had so many clothes that they weren't ever thankful for it and they just kept buying more and buying more. Maybe they just threw it away, never really thinking of the blessing that it was. And that's why we have things that don't last. That's why we have things that break. Things that are all garbage. Things, you know, look, things are mistreated. Things are just chucked in here brand new. We got food, we got all kinds of things in here and when we're unthankful for these things not only are we going to not be getting more we're going to be missing out on the benefit and the blessing that Allah can give us in the future but subhanAllah we might be missing out on a lot of opportunities for good deeds you know how much of this stuff could have been preserved in the first place and used to worship Allah used to donate to poor people downtown food banks used to uh, you know give water to poor people who are thirsty in other countries instead of just being ungrateful for it here or you know, maybe bags of chips, you know, just consumed and thrown away. It's like we don't really think about what we're doing with our wealth. We don't always think about what we're doing with our time. So, you know, inshallah, this can be a time where everyone can, you know, really consider what we're doing. And just look at the immensity. You know, it's that dense of garbage all the way through the entire dumpster. So, inshallah, this Ramadan, we can really you know, rethink about what we're doing with our time and our mon money and our wealth. This is another table that I found today. 
it was broken. People were playing around with it, and you know, I think it was mistreated for a while. So it's now into it's now going to be thrown away. So uh, you know, inshallah, sure everyone can think of this. I ask Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, as uh, Lord of the Worlds, Maliki Omadin, the King of the Day of Judgment, uh, the one who holds everything in uh, his grasp and in his power and his might, to guide us and to allow us to use the blessings we have on this earth. You know, real blessings. Oil turned into plastic, cloth, um, we have plastic for bags, we have tin used for food containers, we have all this wealth, cardboard from trees, wood from trees, actual trees, amazing biological products that are on this earth that can produce air, shelter and shade, these kind of things we just, we don't always think about when we just chop them down and cut them down and consume them and use them for meaningless tasks like, you know, carrying garbage or we just, you know, we mine a whole Fat. We've mined a whole pit in some country, take out tin and zinc and all that, just so we can make like you know cheap food containers and throw them out after one use. Subhanallah. So much waste. This water bottle over here in this garbage bag, I just saw right now, that water bottle is completely full. Completely full. A complete 500 milliliter water bottle is not going to waste. Not going to be drinking by anyone until the day of judgment, until you know the whole uh, time contained period of existence of this universe is over, no one is going to drink out of that water bottle. Unless somehow someone was to rip it open, pour it out, let it get into the trees, let it get into the grass, let it get back into the air system or the water cycle. But most likely it's not going to because it's going to sit in a garbage dump for probably 50 to 100 or however many years Allah knows best. So I just want everyone to really think about what they're doing with the products and really start to use less and use more for the sake of Allah. Using them for the sake of Allah. Not necessarily using a quantity of more objects, but using more of our objects for the sake of Allah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.